Hi everybody. Uh, in this lesson, I will talk about flux direction and how to uh, set the justify content in uh, flux dimensions. So, firstly, I create a new file in uh, the component folder. We have uh, the file of flux sample dot JavaScript. So, this file will contain uh, the React Native component that uh, uh, defines the flexible example. And uh, in this, we have the class flex example inherited from React Native component uh, with the render function. Uh, inside the render function, we have the view. Uh, so the outer view or the main view like a div in uh, HTML. Uh, so I style to this using uh, the object here has a flex of one uh, of uh, or the flex is a positive number. It's okay. Uh, so it is full screen and what about the row row means that inside this uh, the children uh, will be uh, uh, here view 1 view 2 view 3 and view 4 like this as in this animation so we have uh, the uh, second is green the third is blue uh, for example and here I import the component to this uh, flesh uh, example from component slash flesh example and copy this and paste to here yes so uh, you can uh, open the simulator and see the output so we have a tree uh, square a tree view with red green blue so uh, this is uh, this is separated and when you want to export uh, to here if you want to export to here, how can I do this? So it is easy. You can add margin. So here means that margin top, left, right, down, bottom is 20 pixel. And if you want to export to here, this is very simple. You can add margin right to here. For example, 5 pixel margin right and uh, 5 pixel margin right from uh, the green. So this is very easy to implement this. Uh, so what about the second row? We have the first is the row. The duration is row. And if you uh, change to column, it will be like here. The column will start from top to bottom. View 1, view 2, view 3, view 4. So uh, you can see that if you want to add space to here, uh, what can you do? You can add a marking bottom. You can add market bottom here, so we have a two space to adding to be added to here, and now uh, you can create a new uh, another component. Uh, for example, justify content sample. Uh, so my idea is to separate it to uh, to the two component to uh, for you to easier to understand when you download my code. Uh, so inside. The new file justify content sample. We have uh, many prop. Uh, then you can add in separate line uh, by adding separate line for easier to control. So uh, we have a flex. Uh, is one in a separate line of flex the uh, duration in se separate line. So we have a justify content. Uh, for example, if the justify content is flex start, it means that. Uh, it will uh, s uh, add from the start of the uh, component, the parent component. And so uh, let's import to here justify content sample from uh, slash uh, um, current compo uh, current folder components uh, justify content sample and semicolon. Uh, copy justify content sample and paste to here. Okay. So we see that uh, we have the new. So uh, this is means that uh, uh, it start from the top of the column. Uh, first start means start of the column here or the top. Top means start. Okay. So uh, what about the second way we can add a first end? What about first end? First end means that it is end top the uh, so the, the bottom end of the bottom of the column and uh, you can add the background colors for the parent 
a view for example we have the parent view has this color so uh, if you want to uh, you can see it's easier to to uh, distinguish between the view so um, let's change it to to the fixed high we have a fixed high 400 pixel so this size is a 400 pixel so inside this we have some uh of the text in sizes we have red we have green we have blue and uh if you um change the space around or, or space between what about the space between uh space between means that we have the the space here is equal yes we have two space to here is the same or the same size it means it uh, has the same the, the distance between each of the component is uh, the same and uh, you also use the uh, space around what about the space around yes the space around means that uh, the end of the component and the start of the component uh, uh, summarize to this we have a, a, a constant component we have the same component uh, the, the same distance we have the same distance here uh, to di to distance and uh, the end and the start for the, the next distance okay uh, so what about the justify content uh, center it means that it is center of the column yes it is center of the column and so if you change this to a row and the justify content can be the center of the row yes and uh, okay and in the next lesson i will show you detail how to uh, add to the center of the screen it is very interesting uh, thank you very much for watching this lesson uh, please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos and uh, add uh, access to my github uh, for getting my code